welcome back everyone i am bharat i hope you guys are doing absolutely fine in this video we are going to create glue 3.0 locally using docker compose file so without any further delays let's get started let me open up docker desktop here and show there are no containers running and let me show the images i have all the three versions of glue here uh, 1.0 2.0 and 3.0 so we'll be using 3.0 today and let me open up a visual studio code here so i have written the docker compose file here and uh, let me walk you through the same and i'll also leave uh, this file in the description box below so firstly the version this is optional and uh, then we have uh, under services i have created a service called jupiter you can name it whatever you want and the container name this is also optional so this is the entry point command uh, which is used to run jupyter notebook so we have to mention this and then environment variables uh, we can set disable ssl is equal to true this is crucial as well for the container to run without any uh, errors and then we specify the image so here you can see this is 3.0 and then specify the ports that we want to expose this is the host and the container ports so we also mention restart as always or you can even set up uh, rules for restart let's say if it fails for some n x number of times you want to restart only for that number of times and then it stops and then we specify volumes here so first thing we are mounting is our aws credentials so we first specify the aws uh, credentials folder from our host and then specify it for the container likewise we also mention for uh, workspace so firstly we have to create a folder or the complete path that we are trying to mount from the host side so we have to make sure this folder exists in that path so here i have just created a folder called glue jupyter workspace under c drive here you can see in the C drive I've created this folder called Glue Jupyter Workspace and then I'm mounting it into the container uh, the existing folder part so now let's quickly open up terminal and uh, try to run this here I have opened it let's try to run this docker compose file let's type in docker compose up hyphen d so hyphen is d is for detach mode let's click enter now let's wait for a few seconds here you can see uh, the glue jupyter uh, uh, container is created let's go to docker desktop and here you can see so under services we have this container running now let's open up browser and try to access localhost 8888 Here you can see the new UI for this uh, Jupyter notebook where we have this uh, Jupyter lab. Here you can create a Python 3 file where you can run your PySpark code as well and glue scripts. Uh, also you can directly use the glue notebook that you can create and even for Scala. You can work on with the ripple that is uh, like directly with the console. You can just test out few commands or you can op open up a terminal and uh, just try to run all the Unix commands there unix or linux commands and then you can create text files or python files or some markup files and all that stuff so that is it for this video guys if you found this was helpful hit down the like button share it with your friends and drop your valuable thoughts and suggestions in the comment section below don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you haven't yet and hit on the notification bell so you never miss out any of the latest updates thank you for watching look forward to meet you guys in the upcoming videos